Chef William Pauly serves up plenty of fermented food at his restaurant, Confluence Kombucha. We do sauerkraut, we do um, kimchi, we pickle. He also brews more than 100 flavors of kombucha, a fermented tea trending in the U.S. I would say every day you need to have something cultured, pickled, or fermented. Pauly's love for fermented food was born during a two-year stint in South Korea. He had painful stomach ulcers growing up. They disappeared in Korea, where fermented food is king. But there I got a little bit more balanced. Um, the cuisine, you know, fermented foods, it, like, it really balanced me out. Dan Brewer is a licensed dietitian who agrees fermented foods are great for your gut. The healthier your gut is, uh, the healthier overall well-being will be. Fermented foods are also thought to reduce heart disease, type 2 diabetes, and even social anxiety. I think that there are a lot of health benefits to consuming and making fermented foods. Another popular fermented food is the South Korean dish kimchi, which Dan Brewer says also has anti-cancer, anti-obesity, and anti-aging properties. It should just be part of your diet like everything else. Tasty as well as healthy. Brewers honey fermented peaches and apples, fermented butter, and acorn squash kimchi all pack intense flavor. Pauly's ulcers are now gone for good, which he credits to drinking kombucha every day. When I started like feeling better, like it really changed like the way that I interacted with the world. And that's something we can all aspire to do. I'm Marty Salt reporting.